Gary, at the end of 90 minutes, I'm sure we're delighted, but I assume that at half time you weren't as happy. Um, I, d I don't think that's really the case because I thought um, West Ham came here with a, an idea to uh, to keep it tight and um, hopefully create an atmosphere which would enable them to uh, to, to get more from the game. Um, but I don't think they had the first um, effort or foray into into our box until about 43 minutes, and um, <coughs> you know we uh, we often puffed a little bit without creating a, a huge amount. And um, you know in Kevin Davis we've got a. a a player there who, who most clubs don't relish playing against at all. In the second half, uh, we utilised his, his qualities a lot more, and uh, consequently, uh, West Ham struggled with that. But uh, you know, the first half, I was I was quite pleased with. You know, they've they've not done a thing. We've had uh, more efforts and more attempts, more corners, everything. Um, it's it's just that we fell into a, a, a false sense of security in terms of just passing and passing for the passing's sake, and uh, and in the second half, we stepped it up a little bit and pass, but then uh, with a lot more of an end product. Certainly an end product with the first goal, which was tremendous by Lee. I heard somebody say, I think it was Merce on your, your bloody programme today, said something about, well, if uh, if Wolves were going to uh, to Bolton, you'd need a big, strong, physical side. And it, you know, everybody keeps saying this, and it makes me giggle a little bit, that, uh, you know, we're supposedly uh, strong and physical, and then out trots uh, Chung Yong and uh, and uh, Matt Taylor, Paul Robinson, they're all five foot five at, uh, at best. We're not a big physical team at all. We're trying to change that. And um, you know we're trying to get a little bit more pleasing on the eye. We're trying to get a little bit more patience, um, but that will take a little bit of time for everybody to get used to. But again, we scored three goals at uh, at home. This time, our defending and our shape was um, was a much uh, much better. Were you anxious at all when West Ham got their equalising goal so soon after you'd gone in front? I was because it's uh, you know that's how it's been going for us. But the, yeah, you know it's an excellent goal from West Ham's point of view, the passing. But from our point of view, it was a bit after you, Claude. Um, you know we didn't put a tattle in, uh, we didn't get close enough, and um, you know those kind of goals at Premiership level just sh shouldn't happen. It's more of a five-a-side goal, um, and that happened to us uh, again on Saturday with uh, Tevez's. Um, no, it was a second goal, Mika Richards. We should have stopped Tevez getting away from the uh, from the touchline, but. You know, as I say, we've got players in our team who are very good going forward, but um, you're not particularly good um, in uh, in terms of physique. You asked your supporters to get behind the team tonight. They're obviously uneasy and a little bit nervous, probably a bit like the team at the kickoff. But towards the end, you really did win them over. Loudest have been this season at times. <coughs> no, it's um, you know we're not we're not going to get that road. You're not going to get me down that road at all. Um, our spectators today, uh, you know, they they got behind it when uh, when we got three one. There's no no problem, but uh, they are. As, as anxious as uh, as myself and the players, everybody, when we're one nil up and not strolling it, but you know they they'd not been near us at all. When it goes to one one, you suddenly start that uh, that little bit of apprehension, that little bit of self doubt starts to creep in. And for maybe three or four minutes after that, it did do. But uh, you know we were thankful um, for the goal that Klaas got to uh, to enable us to take the lead again. And having got your second home win of the season, three crucial games to come over the over the Christmas period as well to to try and lift you away from the position you're in. Well, the position we're in is uh, you know we're, we're one place above third from bottom, and uh, I think it's uh, three points away from twelfth. So it's very close, and um, you know we we've got a really difficult game. I you know I saw Wigan play Stoke uh, the other day, and I thought they were excellent. And um, so it's that's, that's going to be a really tough game for us, but we've got to go there and uh, you know do things that we've done well tonight try and keep them and uh, some of the things we've maybe not done so well improve upon but you know today's a, a, a terrific result you know and uh, people need to understand the circumstances that we were playing in today.